Well guys, today is an exciting day. Nico and myself are heading down to St. Louis and we're gonna hook up with the VAT19 people. We're gonna do a really cool collab. There's a chance this collab could come with a little bit of controversy, so I'm gonna walk you guys through what I'm gonna do and tell you what my thoughts are on it. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna pack up about 40 adult ball pythons and we're gonna be doing an interesting game show. The controversy comes in the fact that some people are gonna think, oh, well, you're you know abusing snakes for entertainment or trying to gain popularity. But the fact is, is that um, we're gonna do everything to make sure these snakes are not harmed or stressed in any ways. In actuality, the most stressful part is probably going to be, you know, being packed up and driving to St. Louis and back. To be honest with you, because if you think about it this way, you know, when you go to a reptile show, you pack your animals up, you put them into an acrylic case. They're sitting there all weekend with people looking at them, and that's a lot of stress too. So we really put a lot of thought into this, and I'm going to explain it as we go to make sure everyone completely understands what our thoughts are so that we can hopefully expose people to a bunch of really cool snakes, have a good time, make people laugh, and eventually maybe get more people watching the vlog and snake bites so that we can continue to spread the message of love of wildlife. So I've got all the snakes packed up. I'm gonna pack up a tarantula, and I guess I've got a shipment of frogs that I'm kind of borrowing from Josh's Frogs. So, uh, by the way, Josh's Frogs, awesome company. They're helping me out a ton on this. They're kind of loaning me some frogs just to show off. Uh, so I'll put the link in the description to Josh's Frogs because they're an awesome company. If you like amphibians, definitely check those guys out. Uh, let's go see what they sent us. They certainly did a, an awesome job, and that's going to be great. So a red-eyed tree frog, uh, dendrobated, um, red-spotted, uh, red-spotted uh, tree toad, and then a green tree frog. I don't know, whatever it was. Anyways, regardless, they, they sent us four really cool frogs, and we'll be able to show off and get the people over at Bat 19 really excited. So, uh, okay, now the idea is uh, you can see Genesis over here carrying up this stuff. Look at those guys. Yeah. This guy's muscles, man. Look at this guy's muscles. Holy cow. <laughs> so we have to get this packed up into the vehicle and uh, get out of here. Yeah! Alright guys, so we are off. Just Nico and myself, uh, but there was one little problem. As soon as we hit the road, I was thinking, oh, you know, I wonder how much gas this rental van has, because we always rent vans when we're traveling, just not to put miles on our own vehicle. Uh, but this is the gas gauge right there. See right there? The problem is, it doesn't work. And this is a brand new vehicle, so uh, I'm sure it's just a button on it that needs to be fixed. So I have to stop by the uh, Enterprise where I rented it and have them tell me what the heck is going on because, uh, what you got, Max and Neve? Yeah. <laughs> oh, what do you mean? The gas is right here. Hang on a second. I no, mean, it's no... not that. Okay, so if oh, it so was it on full, so oh, so if I was it was thinking... on full, it would go all the way up. This is how stupid I am. Okay, see these dots right here? That tells me that it's full. I thought these lit up to be red or green, and then we go down. But obviously, I was completely wrong. So, yeah, I'm pr I'm pretty smart. about three hours outside of St. Louis right now, just outside of Indianapolis, an absolutely gorgeous day. I love traveling on sunny days. It just makes me feel alive, and it's just been a really beautiful trip. Uh, it'll also be nice to be into St. Louis. Hopefully, if things go well, we'll get into St. Louis early enough to where we can venture around the city a little bit and check it out and see what's going on before the shoot tomorrow, which I am over the top excited about. It's sometimes just weird to think that I'm just some snake guy that just, you know, is living a dream, really, and here I am 
am, you know, a big fan of VAT19 and all the stuff they've done for the last several years on YouTube and their products. And uh, we're gonna spend the day with them tomorrow filming with them. So for all these years I've been watching them thinking they're super cool. And guess what? Now I get a chance to go hang out with them and have a good time. So uh, we're gonna uh, saddle up, hit the road. Hopefully we'll be in St. Louis about three hours. Check that place out and uh, get some rest and have a great day tomorrow. So literally guys, I never, ever, ever eat fast food, but Chick-fil-A, it's really not fast food. You gotta make an exception. <laughs> got to. When Lori sees this, she's gonna freak out because she knows like I am an anti-fast food person, but Chick-fil-A is pretty awesome. It's been about, it's been a while since I've had one, but uh, I have to break the rules every now and then, right? And hey, once I'm uh, out of the state, I'm in a different zip code. I can, uh, I can cheat. Oh wait, that's a different type of cheating. I thought about cheating food. In a different zip yeah, code. Yeah, no, I, that's, same thing. Yeah, it's, it's, it's the same principle. <laughs> same, same principle. Okay. Mm -hmm. Man, how do you feel being stuck behind this dick? Guys, we made it to the St. Louis Arch right over here. And of course, we have all the city on this side here. Definitely a cool place. Nico, it's the first time he's ever been to St. Louis. So, uh, first time. I know, so he gets to see the arch. And uh, I mean, really a cool city, a beautiful night. Um, so yeah, it's pretty awesome here. So we're just gonna kind of check the rest of the place out. Barbecue good here, guys? Is it good? Worth doing? Oh, yeah. 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 All right. What do you think, man? You want to grab something? Yeah, we can grab something. Want to grab something? What? Sold out of ribs. Sold out of ribs. Gooey butter cake soda? That's exactly just what I was looking at. What? Uh, you want mac and cheese, are you? Yeah. Yeah. Copycat? Hey, yeah. look at you. got everything? You better, better hurry yourself up there. That was so damn good. I tell you what, I have eaten unbelievably glad on this trip, and you know what, I don't even care. I'm not even gonna complain. I'll just have to make up for it when I get back, work at the gym even harder, but that dinner was crazy good. And tomorrow, you know what, we're gonna be eating some even crazier stuff. Candy bacon and gummy snakes and yeah. all kinds of crazy stuff. Vat 19 you know buffet. Vat 19 buffet, man, I don't even care. All right, well, it might be time to start heading back to the hotel. We've got about a half hour drive to the hotel. Get some rest because we got an early morning and a long day of filming tomorrow. But uh, St. Louis, a thumbs up, guys. getting the big snake into the elevator because it didn't fit through the doorway here uh, on the cart. So we have to drag it out, I guess. I'm not exactly sure how, but we'll get it in here. Okay guys, so we are in the room. Finally loaded the animals and the camera gear. Um, so we're here.
So here's our room. Nico is fastly trying to figure out if snake bites, how's that looking? Uh, well, it's at zero percent right now. Uh, Does it have a number or no? No, not yet. Mm, that's not good. So it is 9.32 our time, which means it's 10.30 back home. So and it's about three this, hours. And this has to be uploaded for the morning. So if it says three hours, we're, we'll be okay. But uh, anyways, nothing uh, major here, guys. A couple beds, lots of camera gear, bunch of animals, and that's it. So I tell you what, it's been a long day. We're going to get settled in here and try to get some rest because it's going to be an early morning and uh, tomorrow's going to be absolutely awesome. So I hope you guys, as you're watching this, are going to have an amazing rest of your day.